हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू डी कप्टारो माई नेम इज़ रेया एंड इन टू डेज वीडियो वी गोइंग टू बी टेकिंग अ लुक एट वॉट ब्लेसिंग्स आर कमिंग इन योर लाइफ एज अ रिजल्ट ऑफ द एक्लिप्स दैट वी आर गोइंग बी एक्सपीरियंसिंग दिस मंथ ओके नाउ एज यूजल यू हैव थ्री पाइल्स इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू सो वेन इट कम्स टू सिलेक्टिंग योर पाइल प्लीज मेक श्योर यू पिक वन अकॉर्डिंग टू द इमेज द फेदर्स और द प्लेट्स which ever you feel like you're most drawn to and of course after you've done with that we start with pile 1 hello and if you've selected pile 1 then these are the blessings that are coming into your life as a result of the eclipse now for you pile 1 the biggest blessing that is coming is the blessing of clarity so right now in certain areas of your life you're not sure what to do or you're not sure how to go about things or what is right and what is wrong for you you will be given the clarity to make your decisions forward and to move ahead forward in a way that is right for you and see when you get clarity you know you will not make mistakes that is the message i'm really getting so the biggest blessing is that of clarity let's take a look at your tarot you have 6 of pentacles you have the hermit you have the world okay and you have 10 of pentacles i love that already see what is going to happen you know for you one phase of your life is coming to an end like a big karmic cycle for you is coming to an end and it's coming to an end very beautifully it's like you know by the end of this karmic cycle you will get a reward for something that you've done but was massively nice and most of all i'll tell you this this is going to be hitting two areas of your life one is your money area and the second is your family area okay so all the good karma that you've done that is going to be benefiting you in these areas beautifully of course if you're currently involved in some kind of projects or if you're studying for some kind of ex examination know that you will give it successfully and you will enter the next phase successfully at that now the possibility also is you know as a result of the blessings of the solar eclipse you will go on an inward journey a journey to understand yourself and a journey to understand where you want to take your life next and for a couple of you you know it may actually take you on the path of studying now this could actually be you know academic studies or learning from life as well but you're really going into that introverted zone so if in the past you know you've been a little bit more extroverted i feel like you're going within for a particular time and then of course you're coming right up so this is two parts of you that will be emerging in the next phase one which you keep to yourself and yourself only and this is second part of you that you display to the world okay so i feel like these two demarcations are going to be very very clear for you financially in fact you're going to be coming into a time where you have more than enough where you have enough to take care of your own needs all of your needs are going to be met you won't have to struggle for that money related issue is what is coming through and you will also have a little bit of money to give away to charity so to somebody in your family who actually needs it but you'll be fine money wise is what is coming through now once again in your family life there is something that is really really good that is happening and there's something that will make you happy but that will also make the generations of your family happy you may also like you know get together with somebody to celebrate things now i'm really seeing a strong possibility of marriage for some of you and marriage of your liking but the liking of your family as well yeah but you're happy you're satisfied and for a couple of you if you sort of get into the bond of marriage right now it may be to somebody who's better than you or financially more capable than you and as a result of this you know you get that lifestyle upgrade but happiness in your family is also indicated now interestingly for you you know there is relationship change so what is happening you know if you are not sure about a couple of family members you're like you know oh i really don't know where this person stands you have to be getting clarity regarding it and as a result of that clarity your relationship will change of course for a couple of you you may actually go from being somebody who's single to actually getting married yeah because we spoke about marriage but relationship changes and being clear about your relationship is also what is indicated Now interestingly one of the blessings that is coming in your life as a result of the eclipse is that of emotional healing 
and that is deep emotional healing it's like you know the wounds that you had in your heart the emotional instability that you had in your heart you will now start healing and remember this healing is a process so when this eclipse hits that is going to be a time where you start the healing process and as the months continue the healing journey will continue yeah but maybe healings in your relationships may also happen now for you it's like you will reclaim your power yeah you're not going to be playing in the shadows anymore you'll be like okay i'm here to live my life fully i'm here to accept myself fully and that is exactly what i'm going to be doing you're reclaiming your power you know you'll come into a point of time after the eclipse will people will start respecting you well people will start respecting your opinions instead of pushing you in the background if that may have happened with you i feel like you're going to be that person who people turn to for advice now yeah you'll be welcomed wherever you go especially in places where people did not really want you in the previous sign now interestingly there is this new person who is coming into your life and this is a new man now remember this of course with a relationship change this could be you know you get meeting somebody you liking them you getting married but sometimes this person can actually be a mentor at work or a teacher for you who has your best interest at heart and will always show you the right way yeah see remember this there are people of various age groups and possibilities in my comment section so and this is the general reading so this is open to interpretation but this person that you meet this man that you meet is having good intentions towards you and once again you're going to be confronting your demons and maybe as a result of confronting your demons you get clarity and because you get clarity the deep emotional healing then comes your way i love when things tie up in the end just like that yeah but you're confronting your de demons you're like i don't want to live in the shadows anymore i want to face things head on and i want to live a life that is happy a life that i really really like to live yeah that's happening now what i'm going to do is i'm also going to be giving you cards from one of here so we'll see once again what other areas are highlighted for you let's see okay okay the month of november for you is going to be very very important so remember of course you know almost by the end of october we are having this eclipse so november onwards you'll gradually see these changes happening in your life yeah i just wanted to give you a time period where it will begin for you so for you it is november and it is really soon so i'm really happy and we'll see the area in which it will happen love okay wow i love this once again you know it is like getting more love into your life your family relationships or of course your love life actually your love life when you meeting somebody so the possibility of meeting somebody new is there in the month of november yeah so guys if there's somebody out here who's single then the possibility of you meeting this person is very very soon now i'm also going to be giving you the messages that you need to receive as regards to your blessings from your tea leaf cards let's see a recognition and reward for merit so the things that you deserve you know once again if you're really preparing hard for something if you're really preparing for some kind of project you will get recognition for it and i mentioned you know you're going to be getting respect respect for who you are as a person and for your merit as well a uh, opportunity or a windfall once again as we mentioned you know because financially well being is starting in your life sometimes through marriage or a relationship that is also possible i have two here so i'm going to take both uh, you will receive a gift so some kind of gift is coming your way a long journey either physical or mental will leave you wiser at the end so once again there's a journey awaiting you and this can be both okay this can be either mental or physical two more again a romance celebration or party once again there can be romance on the cards for you i love how you know love messages are really coming forth or maybe you may meet this person at a party or some kind of celebration family get together very very possible and one more keep your life in balance now one area that you may struggle with slightly is keeping your life in balance and okay maybe you know it's like too much happening simultaneously and then you have to find a way to make this work 
but you will i get a feeling because you know the cards are very very positively in your favor and i feel like i want to give you one more uh, karma you will reap what you've sown so once again all the good karma that you've done you're getting it back and i feel like the biggest karma that is hitting you is that you're getting the respect that you deserve especially when it comes to your family okay i'm just instinctively picking up the message of family here yeah that's what's coming through for you and of course because it is requested time and again i'm going to be giving you your letters and numbers r 13 e 25 l f i can be your initials sometimes full names 10 o 69 now this is like you know r o f l laughter so i feel like you know you're going to be happy something is making you really really happy you have number 3 you have t 31 uh, again you have you have an examination yeah so if there's somebody who's preparing for like tofel then i feel like you guys are going to be doing well at it q very specific but it's coming out and you have a you have g and you have s you have j you have h and i'll give a couple of more n you have 44 16 you have i 30 a again o e e oh look at that you have see seeing things clearly getting the clarity about something yeah that's there and 15 and you have a yeah but overall these are the letters and numbers for you and the messages that you need to receive with regards to the blessings that are coming into your life and as always as i wrap this up i want to leave you with all of my blessings for your future i will see you next time bye Hello and if you've selected pile 2 then these are the blessings that are coming in your life as a result of the coming eclipse now of course we start with the very first one and the biggest blessing that is coming is on your wisdom on your intellect on your knowledge and understanding okay so once again you becoming the wisest person you know and honestly with the kind of wisdom and understanding that is coming on you i really don't feel like in the upcoming time you need the guidance or support of somebody you will know what to do you know the right thing to do and you will go according to that so that is the biggest blessing coming into your life and if you are a student then you should be mighty happy about it yeah okay there's judgment four of wands Six of Cups, and you have Eight of Wands. Okay, now let me just tell you the things are going to be moving very, very quickly for you, especially the work that has been pending for a very long time. Or you were hoping that this will work out for me, and it actually does. And it, the pace at which it works will actually surprise you. Things are moving for you beautifully. In fact, the possibility of travel is also there, and I see long distance travel for you. And this trip will be a blessing for you. for some of you you this could actually be like a movement movement of residence movement of job as well but regardless of what this change is regardless of what this movement is it is going to be blessed it is going to be making you happy and fulfilled in your own skin is what is coming through for you yeah but there is a part of you that is also feeling a bit nostalgic okay so maybe in the upcoming time you're going to be meeting people from your past Yeah, but this is like a sweet moment, okay? When you meet these people, you're like, you know, you get reminded of all the times that you were really happy in. So maybe for a couple of you, you know, people that you've known in the past are coming back into your life. And remember, since this is a blessing, it is coming into your life as a blessing. And maybe these people will help you in some areas of your life. you'd be grateful for it or for some of you you could actually be moving to a place where you have people who are familiar to you yeah 
but there's also something good happening in your family yeah this could be you know get together of some sorts or this could be just celebration of course this can be in your family circle as well but this happiness here this just this great sense of satisfaction here and also career changes are highlighted for you a really really massive way yeah career changes because of your own wisdom and understanding yeah so this could play out in multiple ways maybe you acquire a degree and you feel like you know this place of work is not for you you move on to something else or if you're a student you like graduate from university or what class you're in and you move on to something else but that movement is definitely there now one of the biggest blessings that is coming is on your intuition once again wisdom intuition very very linked together so because you're becoming wiser your intuition is uh, you know really helping you ascend to the next level and once again when it comes to intuition you're also benefiting a lot in your spiritual life much more than you have done in the past so maybe for you pal to if you've gotten into a spiritual practice that is actually helping your intuition grow multiple times so stick to whatever you are doing because that is right for you now for you pal to you're also going to be very very focused on what you're doing yeah you're like okay this is my intention this is where i'm going to be focusing and this is what i'm going to do to achieve my goals so maybe in the upcoming time you'll also make firm strategies we are like okay x is my destination x is where i'm going to go and these are the baby steps that i'm going to be taking along the way there'll be no deviation for you anymore if it has been in the past you're very clear about your motives and you're making really really strong progress around it so once again you know you have the eight of wands which is about speed and you have the cheetah which is about maximum speed so speedily you're moving towards your destination financially you are going to be having enough yeah you don't have to worry you'll always have enough and you don't have to depend on somebody else and you know lack of dependency on somebody else is like the first step towards freedom emotional freedom and financial freedom as well and that is what you're getting and remember this the consciousness that you'll be having is i deserve all of this i deserve to be where i am i deserve to have the things that i've earned and i deserve the success in my life yeah that sense of deserving inside you is going to be getting supremely strong you deserve it you clearly do and you are going to be embracing yourself fully and it is a blessing you're going to be embracing yourself with your flaws and your good habits but you also embrace the world see you are going to be giving the other person this sense of like okay maybe this person made a mistake yeah you're going to be much more forgiving than you were previously all right now what i'm going to do is i'm going to be giving you the area that the blessing may come in a lot more okay success okay so basically it's success coming your way and when it comes to success i feel like it's going to be when it comes to your work but success is yours especially if you are planning on going in a new direction or if you feel like you know i really require success here i feel like you'll get it i'll give you the month that is imp important all right september okay now this can work out in two ways you know maybe you already entered one part of success in the month of september and it will keep building up to the next september but because you know september has passed and the next september is far i'll just give you one more to see if you get okay june all right so the next part of you is june yeah so when it comes to the eclipse you know it has i feel like you know started building up for you already and it will peak in the month of june yeah that's coming up for you and now i'm going to be giving you your tea leaf cards for the extra blessings and clarity because tea leaf cards always are more helpful let's see a spiritual guidance and protection from mom as i was mentioning you know whatever spiritual practices that you're doing are working and you'll get spiritual guidance in the future as well and then the voice of intuition the voice of wisdom is the voice of angels for you uh, advice from a friend so very soon you're going to be getting an advice from somebody which will help you in your upcoming time yeah and remember this is guidance that will come after the eclipse okay be mindful of that 
opportunities are waiting for you so once again work related opportunities or study related opportunities will be opening up for you so these are new doors that you will be entering you will be shown the way so remember as i was starting off in the very beginning you don't need anybody to really help you but anything extra that is coming that is just value addition but you will be shown the way let's take a couple of more a guaranteed success so look at that you have two cards of success and both are stars <laughs> look at that yeah so you know when it comes to stars for me it's always about hope the things that you were hopeful towards that will come to light and that is like guaranteed success for you a dealing so relationship with a woman is going to be important and remember for a couple of you this could be somebody from your past somebody you've not connected with in a very long time and she comes off and helps you out hard work ahead but remember especially because the success is guaranteed for you it is depending on the hard work that you do yeah so keep working at whatever it is that you want to work at secret admirer all right now once again there's a secret admirer coming up for a couple of you it could also be like you know the secret admirer for you has been somebody from your past okay past wife that is what i'm really really getting here i'll give you your letters and numbers just to get that clarity you have o you have e you have i o again 26 l you have r d lord presiding over something or worship of the lord hmm if it's calling to you 25 you have i L N thirty three fourteen number thirty R H Y number three twenty two U J you have number ten you have two more. you have role okay so maybe you're going to be playing a different role so once again maybe your designation will change in the upcoming time that may be there for you 31 19 l a f 88 and you have a yeah but overall these are the messages that are meant for you and once again as i wrap this up i want to leave you with my best wishes remember success is guaranteed for you you need to work hard at whatever you're doing right now because you know when you work hard you'll sort of get an innate understanding and with your intuition and wisdom you are right on track i'll leave you here and i'll see you next time bye Hello and if you've selected pile 3 then these are the blessings that are coming into your life as a result of the upcoming eclipse and the biggest blessing that is coming your way pile 3 is a blessing on your day so moving forward you know there's going to be this change inside you where gratitude is a part of your everyday life maybe the changes that are happening in your life make you more grateful for every day and you being very mindful about this see in the upcoming time especially after the eclipse i don't see you guys thinking too much about the future you'll be like what can i do today you'll give your best and you're going to be satisfied with it and i feel like that's like a beautiful state of mind to be in because honestly the present is all we have yeah so that's how it is going to be for you now Okay for you pal 3 you're going to be moving away from something and you're going to be moving away from something that is not giving you satisfaction anymore now that is something that you need to examine you know if you're not happy with your work maybe this will change in terms of your work and if you're not happy in a particular relationship i feel like you'll move away from that yeah you just focused on your peace of mind okay that is what i'm really getting here once again there is a blessing on money for you and it is massively standing strong all the money that you earn right now all the blessings that will come in your direction are going to be things that you deserve 
and you've earned for yourself it's not like you know somebody helps you and you get that money or you somebody helps you or you get that progress it is everything that you have done and worked hard for yeah and for a couple of you you know you'll be able to live a life on your own terms and in a way the life of luxury and whatever luxury means to you sometimes even if you have less you're supremely happy with it and you call that luxury especially i'm giving a shout out to my minimalist friends out here so this is the definition of luxury for you in the upcoming time you're also going to be taking more care of yourself your own needs whether this you know you feel like you want to take a day off you'll be like okay i'm just going to take a day off and if you want to do something you'll do that for yourself you're very comfortable in your own skin in the upcoming time and you're also very strong in a way that biggest blessing that is coming in your direction is nothing can shake you no amount of disharmony can shake you nobody else can shake you other than you yourself so the only person that you need to be concerned about with is your own emotions and your mind because that is the greatest contributor for your sense of well being you're becoming very strong but also in the upcoming time you're going to be becoming more creative so maybe you'll be picking up a new extra hobbies or you will be attending a couple of workshops seminar which make you very very creatively inclined yeah but creativity is really on the rise in your life yes as i mentioned you're becoming very very strong you're maintaining your dignity in the upcoming time you're like i deserve respect and i will not settle for anything short of respect you'll honor your opinions you respect yourself as a result of which you're satisfied and you're at peace nothing bothers you okay post this eclipse so this eclipse is huge when it comes to you and also you're going to be opening yourself up to new possibilities so if you want to make new friends you will go and make new friends if you want to probably change a job you will go and do that so everything that is happening you are deciding it is supposed to be happening and you make it happen you're not leaving anything to chance for your life but also interestingly there is a new person in your life who's coming in your life as a teacher now can be a spiritual teacher or you know this could be a mentor or if you're a student you could actually meet a new teacher who influences your life a great deal like this person really connects with you you're like oh wow you know this is what i was looking for that kind of teacher but he'll teach you a lot and he will almost make you into a version of him you know make you as wise as he is is what i'm really getting here he'll train you in number of ways but also you're opening yourself up you know once again open to possibilities open to new people open to new experiences so you're diversifying for yourself in the past if you've not done that you're really opening up and if you are an introvert then clearly you are changing okay i'm going to be giving you an area where the change is going to be maximum okay wealth okay money wise yes i was telling you you're going to be having more than enough and everything that is coming your way you've earned it yeah you've earned it that's what i get i'll tell you the month that you know the changes are going to be happening for you i feel like i need this april and i need this as well march okay so march april are going to be times where you know the blessings are going to be starting to peak okay because there's always a peak time then all the things hit us because of the planetary changes of course but for you it is march and april yeah i'll give you your tea leaf cards let's see what's coming up for you there as a result of the blessings position of authority now this could come like you know once again you get a position of authority at work or just as an individual because once again you're respecting yourself yeah and when you start respecting yourself that is giving yourself a position of authority and that you're doing yeah and when you respect yourself people automatically fall in line that is my experience a uh, successfully overcoming a problem so right now if there is one area of your life that is particularly problematic you'll move away from it a uh, dealing so relationship with a man with blonde gray or white hair and i'll tell you this this is a description of this teacher and i'm clearly getting this teacher it's a man and you know he has like blonde gray or white hair he'll teach you a lot and 
new opportunities possibilities and paths opening up for you so you have like this new life entirely once again open to infinite possibilities so it is like a multi you know once again double message plenty of material things so once again wealth material things nine of pentacles money wise it's like the biggest blessing ever uh, get back to the basics so once again when it comes to life you know picking something up from scratch doing something from scratch maybe creatively or otherwise but that is what you're going to be doing and you'll get back to the basics happiness oh wow you're, you're just finding happiness once again happiness in everyday life when you find happiness in everyday life you are my kind of people <laughs> and what is this compliments from an admirer so once again people will start admiring you people will start respecting you yeah and multiple people add that seek out information that will help you so once again the possibility is in the upcoming time you may not have some information and you will need to get it from a teacher and you already have this person to help you out and last one stepping into a new experience so you're going to be getting into something that you've not known before and that is going to be good for you yeah and i will give you letters and numbers let's see you have seven you have l you have c e 27 i l n if you want to say no to something i feel like you're going to be comfortable with that and you could be saying no to disrespect that i'll tell you a nora okay is your name nora h or maybe you have a nora in your life with an h if you are that you have e 26 25 O, O again. Five, R. Twenty-seven, sixteen. Number ten. N. You have I. You have X. Sixty-six, Y. A. l and you have e yeah but overall these are the initials that are coming your way along with the months that are going to be important and the area that is going to be important for you post the eclipse and remember these are the blessings that are coming your life and please just say thank you because i feel like out of all the piles you guys are like really hitting the right kind of blessings yeah but overall i will leave you here with nothing but my best wishes i will see you next time bye